Hi and welcome to LEP Automotive. In this video, I'll be talking about the sign your vehicle needs alignment. So, wheel alignment is adjustment on the vehicle's wheel to the manufacturer's specification for the purpose of reducing wear on the vehicle's tire and also to ensure the vehicle travel in a straight path. We have two types of wheel angle alignment, which is the primary alignment and the secondary alignment. But for the purpose of private cars used for domestic use and maybe commercial purpose, we'll be talking on the primary alignment. And on this, we have three different angle adjustments for the primary alignment. One of them is the camber adjustment, we have the coaster adjustments and we have the two adjustments. But the majority of the cars that are manufactured for private use only have two adjustments on the front wheel. The camber adjustment and the coaster adjustment are being fixed and done in the manufacturing process of the vehicle, which is done by the manufacturer in the factory. So the two adjustments is adjustment of the front wheel to ensure that the to reduce wear and also to enable your bed to travel on the straight through path and without pulling to uh, once either the left or the right where your hands are up the steering and even when you put your leg on the brake pedal it doesn't wave to one side. So what are the signs that your vehicle needs? We alignment. Number one sign that you notice that your vehicles need a wheel alignment is that when you are driving your vehicle, you notice that the steering is pulling to one side, either the left or the right. And also when you step on the brake or you take your hands off the wheel, the steering wheel, you notice the steering wheel pulling to either the left or the right. Number two sign that will prove that your vehicle needs realignment is that when you are making a U-turn and when you are not steady on the straight course, when you release the steering, the steering is supposed to return to center. But if the steering did not return and you have to do the turning back yourself, then that is a sign that your vehicle needs a realignment. Another sign to show that your vehicle needs a realignment is that when your steering is off center. Your steering wheel, as you are driving on the straight course, but you notice that your steering wheel is off center. That means turn to SS, turn to one side, to either the left or the right. That is a sign that you need to take your vehicle for realignment to ensure that there's a balance between your, your steering and the wheels on the road. Another sign for you to notice that your vehicle needs a wheel alignment is when you have excessive wear in spots on your vehicle. When you notice that maybe the outer layer of your vehicle's tire is wearing badly, that is a sign that your vehicle needs a wheel alignment. Another sign for you to know that you need a wheel alignment is when you have a loose steering. When there is allowances in your steering, you have to turn before your vehicle start. You turn a little angle before your vehicle start responding to that angle. That is to tell you that your vehicle needs a wheel alignment. So these are some of the signs that you not notice when you are driving your vehicle, and it's a sign to prove to you that you need to take your vehicle to a train alignment specialist that will do the alignment of your wheels. So now I'll be discussing what are the causes of wheel misalignment. So there are factors which could lead to misalignment of your vehicle, which will require you to carry your vehicle for wheel alignment. Number one cause is suspension component wear. So when the suspension of your vehicle could be the chalk as well, it could be the bow joint. It will be tie rod, it will be the upper hand. If one or bushing, if 
from the combat bushing stiff or bearing. If any of these components have issues with my rib, after fixing them or replacing those worn out parts, it will be required that you take your bed for the realignment to ensure that the wheel angle is balanced with your steering arm. Another thing that could cause uh, wheel misalignment is driving into heavy potholes. When you are driving along the road and you are running on a running on deep potholes or rough surface road, that is a possible cause. You need to ensure that routinely you take your vehicle for alignment to ensure that the vehicle is not. Yeah, the wheels are not uh, misaligned and if there is any damaged component on the suspension it should be replaced and alignment should be done by your brain. One other factor that could cause wheel misalignment is crashing into large road obstacles. So where there are heavy equipment on the road, wood, pavement and you are driving on a high speed jumping into them, those things can affect your alignment of your vehicle by damaging some of the suspension components. So as soon as you run into such issues and you discover your, you're having the signs of misalignment, then it's necessary that you take your vehicle to automobile workshop where those damaged or worn out components are replaced and uh, your vehicle should be taken for realignment to ensure that you have a balance between your vehicles wheel and your steering while you are driving on the road. One other factor which could affect the vehicle's alignment, wheel alignment, is when you park your vehicle on the very bent, rough uh, pavement forcefully. You use force to climb that pavement and you park the vehicle there like that for a long time. Gradually, it's going to affect the suspensions and gradually the bushings and automatically can cause your best breath to misalign. When your wheel misaligned, it's necessary. You need to take the vehicle for inspection. Those damaged part, uh, components, you get them replaced and you ensure that uh, your vehicle is, wheel alignment is done. So these are some of the signs that your vehicle needs a uh, wheel alignment and the cause is the thing that can lead to uh, your vehicle for getting uh, misaligned. Take your vehicle for routine inspection and maintenance and make sure those damaged suspension components are fixed and uh, wheel, your wheel alignment is carried out and uh, to ensure that your vehicle is staying properly or your steering handling is in good condition. Uh, thank you for watching this video and uh, please subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification button so that whenever I release a new video.